most brokerages and teams have trainings and the trainings don't get to like college courses are 101, 201, 301. What I see across the board with most traditional brokerages is they just have 101. So they have CMA training mm-hmm. 101, list press 101. What's fascinating about delineating these different groups based on amount of unit sales, volume and or time in the business, which we are actually implementing this strategy starting in 2020 as well. Our delineation is one to 16 transactions, 17 to 32 transactions, and anyone that does more than 32 transactions. And then in that camp, there's two groups, anyone that does more than 32, that's a solo, and anyone that does more than 32, that has a team. And I am going to create, we are going to create at KW Elite, which we just launched, I don't know if you know this, a Keller Williams brokerage in Omaha last month. So we're pretty new at this. We're going to create four different training curriculums with four different trainers and each trainer of each group is going to also serve as their mentor, their accountability coach and lead a mastermind every month with that group. And this is the biggest failure in my opinion. And I'd love to hear what you have to say on this Um, from a brokerage standpoint. I feel like brokers do a good job, maybe onboarding an agent, teaching them all the bare minimum, but do not do a very good job taking them to the next level. And it sounds like you guys have actually put some time and thought into that. So what would be some of the things you're doing to help people progress to that next level? So um, I agree totally. I mean, I think there's such a lack of, of like there's the basics that are out there, but there's such a lack of like the actual, like how you grow in the business. Um, You know, I think we, we do a lot of, um, I think one of the most important things of being able to do that is the one-on-ones that I do with my agents that we really talk about what their goals are and how do you get there. Um, And and, is that weekly or by, by monthly? How often do you do that? It's bi monthly. And, um, you know, that's where we talk about, like, you know, we set short term goals, we look at, you know, where are their sucks in their business that they need to, to overcome. But it's, you know, I think I've worked with a business coach over, oh, gosh, I mean, for about 12 years, um, mm-hmm. a couple different ones. And um, I think that that is, you know, having that other perspective, helping you think of things that you hadn't even thought of for yourself, you know, planting those seeds is one of the most important things that I can do as their mentor. Yeah. 